What's going on there folks? Good evening. It's the Earth Master here on this beautiful Tuesday night, September 13th, 2022, about 6.44 p.m. Notice that signature right there on the seismograph station showing up pretty strongly on the graph. That is coming from a 4.4 earthquake in the area of Northern California. Just coming into the seismograph stations here. Looks like just north of the Bay Area, right there on the map. Again, uh, an earthquake just coming in to the seismographs as a 4.4 earthquake on the map. Let's go ahead and check out latest details here from the USGS showing that uh, earthquake there in the red circle. Looks like it's uh, just north of the Bay Area, right around the Santa Rosa area right now coming in. 4.4 at 7.5 kilometers deep this is off of the rogers creek fault zone uh, kind of looks like it is a lengthy fault i haven't really seen too much activity on that fault system in uh, recent times um, but again this this earthquake just coming in folks let's see if anybody felt it uh, already getting some reports of some uh, folks reporting it right around the bay area it looks like i'm sure this will fill in much more stronger or much more uh, uh, active as people um, phone it in or report it in. Uh, see if it's been reviewed yet by a seismologist. It's still at an automatic status. Let's go ahead and refresh this, make sure. Automatic status, 4.4 uh, at 7.5 kilometers. Uh, shake alert uh, from the USGS out there. I didn't feel it up here in uh, Chico, looks like uh, potential areas that could feel it far away I guess maybe Ukiah maybe portions of the Sacramento Valley as well uh, and into the Delta around Vacaville and the Fairfield area uh, we know a few folks reported feeling that earthquake in San Francisco already because they have reported it uh, it looks like uh, let's see shake alert messages were sent out that's the uh, early shake the my shake map i didn't get anything here but uh, again i'm out of that zone uh some systems reporting it as a 5.0 magnitude earthquake so we will see what the original um magnitude is on this earthquake let's see what we got here for the waveforms let's see if we can access that real quick here and it's probably going to give me a hundred different stations up here. Uh, let's see what we got. Um, let's check out Columbia College in the Columbia area, which looks like it's only uh, just a short distance away from the epicenter. That's kind of what we're seeing there on the live seismograph station there uh, up in the Petrolia area. Notice that uh, the signature right there, pretty uh, lengthy it looks like. Uh, to me, this could be a, uh, I'm just guessing here by this seismograph, uh, a rolling type feeling from this earthquake. A lot of times you can tell when it's a sudden jolt uh, or a, uh, um, you know, a, a quick jolt type earthquake. This here looks like it's uh, kind of a long duration uh, earthquake. So possibly a, um, you know, rolling type or wavy motion feeling um, from that earthquake that uh, folks may have felt. So uh, let us know. If you did feel this earthquake there in the Santa Rosa area, again, this is just about uh, oh, a couple miles or so, I believe, from the epicenter area. So well, let's go back here and double check. Refresh this page, even though it refreshes itself. I want to see what the latest data is here uh, with this earthquake. So it has been reviewed right now. So it looks like the USGS has jump on, jumped on it pretty quickly uh, for a 4.4 magnitude earthquake at 7.5 kilometers. And again, some of these reports are coming in uh, much, uh, much stronger right now. All right, we'll be back uh, a little bit, uh, probably about an hour or so with a complete update, folks, on this earthquake striking in Northern California, right around the Santa Rosa area, north of the bay on the Rogers Creek Fault Zone. We'll take a look at that and more uh, in our update here in about an hour or so. 
Uh, be a little bit around 8 o'clock West Coast time here, 8 p.m. West Coast time, uh, 11, 11 o'clock Eastern time. So let us know if you felt it, though, uh, in the comments below. Kind of curious to see what it may have felt like for uh, you folks that did feel that earthquake. All right, till then, uh, we'll catch you guys on the update video. Peace out.